Peel in London for Radio Bremen Fair. And this is Kendall Smith. <laughs> Sharpsville massacre, mother lose son and also daughter, father have to sit and hide their anger, frustration, it was a little higher cause the people in the township would always suffer, from Pretoria to Botswana, from Johannesburg across to Namibia, still the white middle class just a think them so and then no more for a fuck, we under pressure. Just like the lamb when it fight against the tiger. Just like the mouse when it fight against the cobra. Black man decide him now go take it no longer. Start playing kick in the face of the oppressor. And all of the white man have to run for cover. Sure. Um Canton West is where that is our party. Them command at the wing of the ANC. Um Canton West is where that is our party. Them command at the wing of the ANC. Now the one Mr. Bota is a slave master. Him in the same category as Margaret Thatcher. Cause the one who got the money is the one who got the power. And black man not home, only got one another. And now we decide we not go take it no longer. We take out the gun and we take out the dagger. Put away all the fun. And all of the love that we get up, stand up, and we praise to the Father to help us overcome the wicked, oppressor. More blood it a go run, more bones will shatter. Some of it will be red, and some will be yellow. But look out, look out, and we pull the trigger. But look out, look out, and we pull the trigger. But look out, look out, and we pull the trigger. Oh, can't oh. West is where that is our party. Them command at the wing of the ANC. Um, can't West is where that is our party. Them command at the wing of the ANC. That's Kendall Smith and Conto Way Siswe, and it comes from an LP called Time Running Out, produced by The Mad Professor. And somebody in the studio with me said, uh, that little Zola Bud's going to miss the reggae now that she's back home in Bloemfontein, <laughs> which I think was quite good. And it's worth pointing out, incidentally, I don't know how much there's been in the German newspapers about uh, our alleged mistreatment of uh, Zola Bud and so forth, but uh, uh, she managed to get her British passport and British nationality in time for the Olympic Games in something like 11 days, whereas uh, a black footballer called Cyril Regis and he's just one of uh, many thousands of people in a similar situation who's lived in this country since he was six and has, I think, on occasion played for England, applied for his nationality papers some 18 months ago and hasn't even received an acknowledgement of it yet. So that's the way things usually work unless you're going to win a medal in the Olympics and you're white. 